Zuli. Chumcha, chumcha. Ah. Uh-huh. Ah, me, Tenki. Mifwa. Aspa Pipiwa. Who's Mavadish? Ah. Ah. Been quiet. Hey guys, welcome on back. And if you are new, welcome on in. My name is Samavala, and today I am bringing you guys a brand new, actually the very first episode of my Sims 4 Horse Ranch series Let's Play called August Rain. Now, last week I did put out a backstory machinima of August and Tyson's love <laughs> you know you guys got to really know them their love and how they met and all that stuff and if you haven't seen that machinima i would advise you to go watch it so you guys can really get to know them i will have the link in the description below but before we begin i really want to take a moment and i really want to say thank you so much for your comments your kind words it meant so much to me because I worked so hard on this machinima. I even got voiceovers, you know, from family members because I just wanted to get their story right. And I was so freaking nervous, but you guys made me feel really good. And uh, I just want to thank you guys for all your support. So I appreciate you so much. Um, August had arrived to the farm, to the ranch, and she was absolutely devastated. And right now, her and Tyson are just laying in the bed. They are sleeping. They're not even cuddling. But you know what, guys? Let's get right into the Let's Play. All right. So, we are here at the Davis Ranch. And, yeah. So, look. On this side here, we have the training grounds. It's a huge lot. It's a 64 by 64 lot. On the other side, we have another field over here. And you know, guys, when August 1st arrived, um, if you watched the first video of their backstory, you see at the end, she was horrified. Why? Because this is Tyson's winery. He has a table set up. <laughs> like, yo, bro, like, where is the winery? You know, August thought that she was going to walk in and it was going to be a beautiful building with vineyards, you know, just a classic winery. That's what she was thinking in her mind. Even though Tyson basically told her, you know, my family owns a ranch and we have a winery, he never really described it to her, so she made it up her own description of what she thought his winery was <laughs> but man yeah she was really disappointed okay so let me give you an aerial view of the lot on this side over here you know tyson has his two cows um and then he has some goats and sheep i think he has about four goats and he has three sheep um, we have coconut here, we have rascal, we have, um, we didn't name this one, <laughs> so it's still, we gotta, re we gotta name it, I guess he's gonna let, um, August name that one, um, and then we also have marshmallow, we have pillow, and this is butterscotch, okay, um, and then I'm gonna show you guys, well, he has the house, he has this huge barn. It's like two levels. And then he has a greenhouse over there in the back. Uh, let me take you guys inside of the house, which is what really horrified August. I mean, look at it, guys. It's old. It's cracked. It's just, it needs work, you know? It's not that Tyson doesn't have taste. It's just that he was keeping it 
basically as is when his um, grandfather passed away. He just left everything. Okay, so here is August. You know, she's all bougie out. She's all dressed up. <laughs> but this is the house, guys. Nothing is just like, this is how they do things. They only live within their means. You know what I'm saying? Like nothing, there's nothing fancy about it. They make do with what they got. They pick up things at the uh, at yard sales. And, you know, if their neighbor's throwing something out, they're going to pick it up, okay? So there's a bathroom downstairs, and you have your living room. You have your little office, and this is the kitchen. Now, upstairs here, this is where Tyson's daughter will come and stay when he has her you know, over like for the weekend or, you know, a couple of days, you know, during the week and whatnot. He shares custody with his ex-wife. Um, and then this is just an empty room where, you know, he keeps a lot of his storage, his baggage and all that. Um, and it's just one bathroom upstairs. And this is where Tyson has been sleeping. This is his room, which is now his and August's room. She's not having it, guys. August is not having it. Um, and then when you come over here, this is the top of the barn. I don't know exactly what we can do with it, but we're going to do something. We're going to do something. Um, and this is where the horses will stay. I'm thinking about getting more horses as time goes on. And this is their greenhouse. Um, and then we have, you know, where we're going to plant some food because we are living on a simple living trait lot. <laughs> wow, August is about to get a rude awakening. Okay, and she's just dressed like this, you know, because she is just fancy as can be. All right, so let's get right into the gameplay. August is hungry, hun, but I don't think we can actually cook anything because we don't have any ingredients. We only have a fruit salad. Um, yeah, this is definitely a kick in the face. <laughs> But, you know, August is actually really, really happy. As you can see, we have all these moodlets here. Um, we have, uh, basically, you know, she just got married to Tyson. She kicked a coffee habit. She's She loves the little baby sheeps. Then there's Tyson feeling all comfy. You know, look at him. And he's just in love, too. Yes, there is garbage on the floor. <laughs> Tyson, all you have to do is simply just pick it up. So let me show you guys. Um, let's get to know them a little bit more better. So August is a homebody. She's materialistic and she's squirmish. She's squirmish. <laughs> she is currently on birth control, which is good. Um, she's immune to tuberculosis and yeah, obviously she's married. So she, she prefers an exclusive romantic relationship. Um, normal immune. This is all healthy stuff, but she's neutral about having children. She can have kids. If it happens, it happens. That's the way, um, August is feeling. She's very business savvy. So she's definitely going to help Tyson. Um, with the winery now that he has investors she's gonna help him decorate and do everything that she possibly can she has a fear of failure you know after getting demoted um, at her job she just fears just being a failure so she really wants this marriage to work out she wants to embrace this new lifestyle as much as she can and she has a she's a little she has a little sinister in her. Okay, so now let's look at Tyson. Tyson loves the outdoors. He is a rancher. We know this. He loves the gym. He loves working out. He loves going, you know, jogging. You know, him and August, they always love to go jogging. His immune system is good. He also prefers being exclusive, um, which is why they are married. But he does not want children right now. Because he, I mean, he already has a daughter, you know what I mean? And he had his daughter really, really young. And he's just trying to focus on him. And he wants to enjoy his new marriage with August. Um, and he doesn't want a baby. Um, he's a brewmeister, so, you know, he could brew up some beer. 
obviously, and some nectar. <laughs> um, he's a collector, and he has the hero personality. Look at them. They're so freaking cute. He is so in love with August. He's like, babe, I'm just so happy that you're here. You know, this is, this is what the house needed. We needed you. You bring just such a beautiful energy. Okay, so let's go ahead and buy Butterscotch a toy, and let's get August into the farming life. I have August is gonna get to know Betsy. Good old Betsy. Tyson's over there um, working on what's his horses? I mean horses. Kyle's name? Uh, Grover. <laughs> Grover. Yep, there's August. She's cleaning up Betsy, trying to get to know her. Let's socialize. Hug and pet Betsy. I mean, Olga seems to be happy. I mean, she's beyond flirty, obviously. They just got married. Eleanor Sutherland? Who are you? I've called to inform you that your great great grand. Oh, really? Yes, more money. Yeah. And as far as their money is concerned, they're doing okay, but not well enough. Um, August does have um, some money in her account that she has saved up over the years. She does own her townhouse, so she still has that. You know what, guys? Speaking of August's townhouse, um, let's go and let's take a little quick tour of her townhouse because I got a lot of feedback about how nice her townhouse was but i feel like in the machinima i really didn't showcase it so i really want to show you guys her townhouse because the townhouse will come into play probably in a later episode so let's go take a look we are at del sol valley we are back at august's town home i wanted to show you this town home is a townhouse called three in one and it is by Mr. Okan. And you can get that on the gallery. The only difference that I made as far as the outside of these townhomes is I changed a little bit of the exterior coloring. I added some more palm trees and some benches along the pathway. And of course, you know, August got her Tesla up in the driveway. All right, guys. So this is as soon as you come in to August's place, this is her townhouse, you have a little seating area and this is where she basically has her clients come in, this is where she walks into the front door, they can hang up their jacket and everything like that, this is where August, you know, keeps a little note, she's got a little bit of stack of money <laughs> sitting right there, um, and this is her studio. This is her studio for her clients. They come in. Um, she has the big old mirror. She has all her clothing. Um, selections for them to try on. Now, I'm sure you guys are wondering, what is August going to do? Because her studio is still in Del Sol Valley. Well, she is going to have to recreate the studio at the horse ranch. She doesn't know how. She doesn't even know if clients will even come all the way to Chestnut Ridge. She may have to, you know, she may have to get some new clients. and She may have to change a lot of things. So that is one of August's issues right now. Um, but right now she's just gonna enjoy being at the ranch with her hubby. And she's just going to think about all this later on. Okay, guys. So this is the next level. This is the second floor. And this is where um, August, you know, hangs out with her girlfriends and, you know, sit, sits on the couch, watch the big old TV. This is where her and Tyson, you know, had their first date. Um, this is where the hookup happened. And yeah. <laughs> and all this stuff is all CC. It's all CC items, um, the chair, the carpeting, the couch. Um, I just wanted it to be the welcome sign. I want it to be a very cozy inside of August's home. I just thought this is what represented August the most. She has her tea with her lemons. She has her coffee over there on the other side. A very cute and very small kitchen area. 
So this is the living room space and I love it because everything just blends in. The orange tones with the toy coys and the brown and the, uh, the light cream. It's just really comfy cozy um, for August. Okay, I'm going to take you guys right upstairs. And now as we enter upstairs on the very third level, this is August office this is where she you know checks her emails as um if you guys remember in the machinima this is where she got the email about tyson being her new client so hopefully we can replicate this at the horse ranch and this is august's bedroom keeping it still with those very light orange peachy tones little cream color i like it because this bedroom is really simple she has all her cosmetics over there in the corner she's got a nice little bottle of wine that she left behind um because you know she's going to the ranch with the winery she just thought she was gonna be balling and you know but anyway <laughs> Anyway, but she has her own little bathroom, her own little master suite. And that's something that August does not have at the horse ranch. So, guys, we're going to have to do a lot of redecorating, a lot of renovating of the horse ranch. But I want to show you guys August's special place. And this is it. This is where she comes outside. You know, she sips on her coffee. She's thinking about what's going to be happening, you know, um for the day and stuff like that so i love this townhouse i love it for august um and, so, and it's a keeper because she's definitely gonna come back here she's gonna visit her girlfriends and yeah there's some drama that's gonna happen guys just wait and see i can't wait okay getting back to chestnut Ridge. let's go back we are back and august is still you know trying to take care of old betsy um, but she doesn't know what she's doing at all. She's just trying to help out in any way that she can. She's trying to be positive. I mean, after all, guys, this is day one. You know what I'm saying? Tyson's over here. He's doing the laundry. And you know what, guys? Being that this is like the first episode, I really want to start with taking you guys on a little bit of a journey. So I'm not trying to rush anything. I'm trying to give you piece by piece of what it's like to be August from her perspective, also from Tyson's perspective, just getting to know the Sims, you know what I'm saying? And their life on the horse ranch. Yes, this pillow and this is coconut. They are wanting some attention. Okay, August, after your bath, we are going to have August play with Butterscotch. So we're going to ask Butterscotch to come and play. We have to really get to know Butterscotch. And Tyson wants to buy August a horse as well. Um, look at her, already changing. <laughs> This is August. She has to be fashionably ready all the time. Okay, she's going to come and she's going to go play with Butterscotch and get to know Butterscotch. This is a huge ranch. So it's definitely going to take time for them to get through their daily um, chores. Okay, where's Butterscotch? Yeah, Butterscotch is going to become, there he is. Okay, okay, so there he goes. He's playing. She's got him to play. So he's no longer bored. Yes She's like wow, you really like that big old ball What's wrong August Come on Tyson. What are you doing? Oh, he's done with the laundry Tyson. How you doing? He's so good Let's spend some time with wifey She's like, but Tyson, we really need to know what are we going to do with this place? I need to fix up the office. I have all my stuff in storage. He agrees. And his daughter's name is Shayla. So August is going to be asking him when is she going to be meeting her? When is she coming over? It is Saturday. He was like, well, maybe tomorrow. Today, I was hoping to take you around town. 
and I have a surprise for you. It's like a surprise. So Tyson is going to rescue a horse for August to have and to care for. He really wants her to bond with whatever horse he decides to get her. This is going to be hard work for August. So Tyson's going to go pick up the horse. August is running around. She's cleaning up. And you know what? She's not being really squirmish at all. Which is strange for her because she doesn't like icky stuff. You know what I mean? Like picking up manure and taking out the garbage. It's totally not her thing. Okay, so we have Salsa Davis, but I think I'm going to change the name of the horse. Um, I'm thinking, oh my gosh, what? I'm thinking we should name the horse Hershey. There's Hershey. Look at how beautiful. Tyson, hold on, Tyson, hold on. We're going to call over um, August. Uh-oh. Butterscotch is being a little aggressive over there. Oh, my goodness. Um, will he be able to call her? She's too far away. I think she's too far away. Okay, hold on. I'm a little nervous right now for um, August. What's happening? She's just going to be friendly. She's going to be friendly. She's going to talk to. <gasps> She's like, what's going on, Butterscotch? Why are you so upset? It's like Tyson just went, to, went out for a little errand. Okay, good. Okay, August. You're going to have to move away. And Butterscotch, I don't know why you have her backed in the corner. <laughs> okay, come over here, August. It's like, babe. Where did you get this horse from? This is for you, babe. This is Hershey. And I got you the horse. Is she running away? <laughs> She's like, no, thank you. Wait, what do you mean, no, thank you? Hold on, Tyson. You know, we can't just walk away. We can't just walk away. Um, but Nick, we need to get this horse to be non-defiant. Be a little bit more friendly. Come on, August. He's like, August, you got to come over here. You have to be friendly. You have to get to know your horse. Look at August. If she changes her outfit one more time. Oh, my God. She is going through her whole wardrobe in this one day, guys. It's like, okay, I'll get to know the horse. Hi, Hershey. My name is August. And let's see, encourage, you know, talk to, tell a joke. It's like, I'm happy that you're my horse. It's like, I hope that we can get to know each other. Yay, thumbs up. She's like, can I brush you? It's like, does that feel good? Uh-oh. Okay. Don't be too aggressive. Oh, no. August is getting her feeling a little overwhelmed. She's feeling a little nervous. Tyson, you're supposed to come over here. Why are you taking a nap? She's like, Tyson, are we going to go into town and... You know, maybe go to the bar and stuff and check things out. He's like, is that what you want to do, babe? She's like, yeah. He's like, mm, you're so sweet. She's like, do you think I can ride Hershey? Oh, I don't know, August. It takes a lot of time to get to know a horse, you know, to bond. She's like, well, can I just try it? Okay, so we're going to try it, August. We're going to try to have August Mount Hershey. Okay, where are they? Oh, here comes August. She's going to try. And there's Tyson. He's going to watch. Okay, babe, take your time now. Okay, uh, if I can just... Oh, come on, August. You got it. Yes, girl. 
That was good. You're like a pro. Okay, Tyson. Hold on. We're going to get Tyson to mount, to mount Butterscotch. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Reassure. Okay, Hershey's a little tense. Hershey's a little tense. She's She just reassured him. Okay. going to wait until Tyson mounts. Okay. Tyson is now on um, Butterscotch. So let's see if we can gallop over here. Um, canter. Excuse me. Canter. We're going to canter over here close so that we can get close so that we can both ride at the same time. Hopefully it works out. <laughs> okay. Look at him. Look at Tyson. Okay, cowboy. Okay, so now we are going to have... We're going to go for a nice, relaxed ride. And so is Tyson. Hopefully, we can go together. Let's see what happens. Okay, here we go. Let's go, guys. All right. Okay, they're going for a nice, relaxed ride at the same time. Tyson is going to be telling, you know, August everything about her surroundings, what to do, what not to do, who to watch out for, you know. He's like, babe, you know, this is, you're doing so well. I'm so proud of you. Really, Tyson? <laughs> She's so nervous. And the fact, my girl has no shoes on. She has no shoes on. She is really digging deep into her country roots. She has no shoes on. That's because in the barn, you know, they have to take off their shoes. And yeah, she just got on that horse. She just got on her she like nothing. I got to remember to use a lot of the horse's terms. Mount. <laughs> I'm a city girl, guys. You gotta forgive me. Okay, Tyson has to go to the bathroom. He needs to take a shower. He is exhausted. It's been a full day. Look, but look at um August's moods. Look at her. She's good to go because she really didn't do anything today. But they are so in love with each other. I just love them together. Oh, she's like, Tyson, where are you going? She's like, he's like, August, why are you going that way, babe? I don't know. Hershey. Hershey's not listening to me. Tyson, don't leave me. <laughs> oh, guys, they're going separate ways. And she, this one is laughing. She's like, oh, my gosh. This is going to be fun to watch. So it's like, hi. <laughs> She's like, okay, Hershey, be nice to me. They're getting along pretty well. I'm really shocked about how good August is really doing. Tyson, how dare you leave your wife? <laughs> He's like, butterscotch, I had to do it. That's the way I learned. She's going to learn the same way. Grandpa just put me on you when I was young and just let us go. He did that on purpose, guys. She's like, okay, what's the matter? Okay, are we done? She's like, it is getting kind of late. She's like, okay, hold on, hold on. Hold on, Hershey. She's like, okay, take a breath. All right, let's see if we can get her back. Well, you did it, August. You should be proud of yourself. Girl, try to get down off that horse. Yay! All right, Tyson is back in the house. He's taking a bath. He's had a long day. Um... He had a really long day. You know, Tyson started his day about 4 o'clock in the morning. It is now 1 o'clock in the morning on Sunday. And he's just thinking about how how much he loves August. 
and how much he appreciates her enthusiasm. But she is too enthusiastic about decorating and wanting to make a whole lot of changes. But Tyson's biggest concern is when Shayla, his daughter, comes over and meets August for the first time. And not only his daughter, but his ex-wife. She's like, I'm really hungry, Tyson. He's like, I know, baby, but we're going to have to learn. I'm going to have to teach you how, you know, to garden and farm and everything so we can get natural ingredients. They're so cute. They just do this. They're so freaking cute. She's like, babe, did I do good today? He's like, you did great today. She's like, what's on the agenda for tomorrow? Well, you're going to meet Shayla. We're going to go fishing. And we're just going to enjoy the day. All right, guys, here's a little bit of some tea. Last night, before August and Tyson went to bed, August was so hungry. You know, that's where we left off. August was so hungry. She ordered insomnia. She ordered some Subway. It was about 1.30 in the morning. They are just now arriving at 8.30 the next day. Tell me that's not realistic. Because you know August and Tyson now lives in the boonies in, in Chestnut Ridge, right? Yes, this is crazy. They finally got their food. Okay, we're going to let Tyson get it since he only has to take care of um, of this last goat, which is uh, Pumpkin. He's taking care of Pumpkin right now. Pumpkin was the goat that was about to leave. It's like, all right, baby girl, you're doing good. Let me get you all nice and clean here. It's like, babe, this is what I wanted. It's like, I was starving. It's so good. Exactly what I needed. She's like, but wait a second. I can't believe it took so long. Why did it take so long? Well, I mean, the closest town is San, S San Sequoia, babe. <sighs> She's like, well, that, I guess from now on, we're going to have to... Can we hire a chef or something? <laughs> like, babe, we don't have money for a chef. He's like, yeah, I know, my breath is kicking. I gotta go brush my teeth. You gotta go brush your teeth, Tyson. Okay, let's tell her to come in. Come in, baby girl. So he's like, Daddy, where are you? She's going upstairs. She's going upstairs. He's like, baby girl, I'm so glad you're here. She's like, me too, Dad. She's like, we are besties, right? Always and forever. Of course. Baby girl, August is downstairs. Um, Dad's going to go to the bathroom. She's like, I think she was sleeping. Why is she sleeping? It's only 12 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, she's had a pretty long day already. This text, he's like, August, babe, uh, Shayla's upstairs. If you want to, you know, go upstairs. Oh, yeah, of course. Okay, so let's have August for the first time meet Shayla. What can he do? Let's do a funny introduction. He's like, hey, Shayla, I'm, um, August. Hey, how are you? Yeah. I'd rather not. <laughs> August, did she just diss you? August is like, okay, no, August, you can't give up. You can't give up, August. You're going to have to come over here. Friendly introduction. Let's try this again. She's like, hey, girly. Howdy. Howdy? Do you not know how to say hi? Okay, it seems like Shayla does not want to. I don't know what's going on. She's like, you like grilled cheese? She's like, grilled cheese is okay. okay. Oh, she's singing. Okay, I see plus signs. They're getting along. They seem to be getting along well. Okay, August, you know what? August is going to have Shayla, like, take a walk with her or go jogging. 
She's like, hey, Shayla, why don't you show me around? She's like, yeah, I would love to. All right, she's like, come on, Shayla, let's go. Yeah, right behind you. Not, are you serious, little girl? You're supposed to go with, oh, August, stop, 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 because she's not following you. She's supposed to follow you, August. She said yes. Sure, August, let's do something fun. Ooh. He's like, Shayla, what are you doing? Oh, nothing, Daddy. Where's August? Where's August? Um, I don't know. She said she wanted to um run around or something. Weren't you supposed to go with her? Um, no, she just left me here. She just left you here? By yourself? Yeah, Daddy, she's mean. There is August. She's running back. Okay, she thinks she thinks Shayla left. She doesn't even know Shayla never even attempted to go with her. Okay, so she's gonna go talk to Tyson right now. Look at them. They're sitting right there. Okay. Okay. So I feel like Tyson's gonna be a little bit annoyed with August because he really doesn't know the whole thing. But he right now is telling Shayla about the wedding and why she was unable to come. Okay, August is home. Oh, you can't tell her about the honeymoon now. Damn, Tyson. She's like, oh, hi, guys. She's like, Shh. Tyson's like, hold on, August. She's like, Tyson, are you really telling Shayla about marriage and stuff? Oh, yeah, it's time that she knows we're married and I'm not married to her mom anymore. She's like, what happened? She's like, Shayla, you were supposed to go jogging with me. You told me that you were going to go. He's mad. He's like, you left my daughter by herself? Uh-uh. A difficult? They don't have it. Just because, okay, first off, hold on. The Sims and this getting together uh, pack. Just because they have one little argument one little yell at doesn't mean they have a difficult relationship they don't have a difficult relationship their relationship may be difficult right now in this very moment <laughs> tyson i can't believe that he's yelling at august because he you know he's just getting the information wrong from shayla um that's the way she's presenting it as if august left her alone and went jogging when that really wasn't the case no, they don't have a difficult dynamic. So, you know, August is like, what? She's like, wait a second. She's like, babe, let me tell you something. I will never leave a child at home. Never. I asked Shayla to come with me jogging and she did not come. That is just plain and simple as it is. And she's going to give him a little kissy kiss and then everything's going to be fine. Shayla's like, well, okay, well, maybe August is right. If she did say that she wanted me to go jogging, I didn't hear her daddy, and I'm sorry. Um, Tyson seems to enjoy the conversation with August, so that's good. You know, thing, now it's, you know, getting a little bit better. He likes to hear her when she's talking. She's like, babe, I would never do that. So they hugging, they embracing. She's like, what can we do, guys, tonight? She's like, Shayla, do you want to stay and have some popcorn and maybe watch a movie? Sure. And Ty's like, I don't know, babe. It is getting kind of late. I do have to take her home. I'm quite sure I'll be fine. Fruit Simba. Okay, so let's get them ready for... I'm going to have them get ready for their little movie. So she's making the popcorn. Popcorn is popping. She's nervous though, you know, she's a little nervous. She didn't like how Tyson yelled at her and just automatically took Shayla's word over hers. Um, but that's something that they can fix. Okay, she's gonna grab some popcorn. Oh, that popcorn looks burnt, girlfriend. <laughs> that is poor quality, August. You have to. You have to get better, babe. This is not going to impress Shayla at all. Okay. 
Where did Shayla go? Shayla left? Where is she? August, I'm sorry, babe. She's like, Tyson, where's Shayla? She had to go home. It's getting late, babe. It's 10 o'clock at night. She has to go to school in the morning. And her mom told her to run home. Vips -wabi -tabi. She's like, hello? Yeah? He's like, listen. She's like, who was that? Oh, that was Shayla's mom. She's upset about something. I have no idea what. This is Shayla's mom, Jordan. She just came in. She sat her butt down. She feels like she needs to get something off of her chest. Yeah. So she's talking to Tyson. She's like, I can't believe, first of all, you had your daughter over here late. Second of all, this little miss thing over here. Yes. So right away, August gets up and she goes to Jordan. And Jordan's like, I need to tell you something. And then, you know, August is being innocent. She's like, well, it's so nice to meet you. Oh, okay, little Miss August. Let me tell you something. I don't like it when someone is mean to my daughter and my daughter is saying that you were mean to her today. Tyson, you need to let your new wife know how to treat your daughter. And August is like, wait a minute, you don't know the whole story. Like, well, listen, you know, I did my very best today and I was really nice to Shayla. She's like, I can't believe you're actually coming over here and just want to fuss and yell at us. I'm leaving, Tyson. You handle her. Tyson, are you going to say anything? Tyson's like, Jordan, what's your problem? My problem is, Tyson, that you go to Delso Valley and all of a sudden you come back with a wife. You didn't tell me. You didn't really let Shayla know. This is a big surprise to us. And that's not how you treat your family. Oh, we're family now, Jordan. Jordan, we've been divorced now for about five years, okay? And Shayla understands that I am now married to August. Wait now, not my girl August coming in with another outfit change. Jordan now is telling August, listen, I'm just here because I am trying to protect my daughter and Tyson's like whoa there's no need to be protective August is a beautiful person she loves Shayla already and I love her and you Jordan are gonna have to get used to August being here Ooh, I know that face August that's a face of satisfaction honey yes August got her way she's like that's my man and he's backing me up yes so you know you could take your self back home thank you very much <laughs> august is very happy that tyson has had her back um during this awkward situation i mean come on ex-wife coming in trying to tell august what to do and how to do it oh no 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 guys look at her she's angry the ex-wife is angry she's pissed off she never really seen tyson with anyone else um, Tyson has had flings here and there, but now that Tyson is married, like married, married, and everything happened so suddenly, Jordan is not liking it at all, and I feel like Jordan is going to be a problem. Alright guys, I am going to be leaving the episode right here because poor Tyson <laughs> needs to take a nap after all of that but no seriously um Tyson's got a lot of drama coming his way he has his ex-wife now um wanting to be more involved because she didn't like the way things were handled with him getting married to August and poor August she's just trying to get used to the living on the ranch and the whole lifestyle but in the next episode we are definitely going to renovate some of the rooms on the ranch and August is going to be learning a whole lot more about taking care of those animals and of course how to deal with the damn ex-wife and really getting to know Shayla a little bit more. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you are new and you haven't had a chance, please hit the subscribe button. And yeah, I hope to see you guys next time. Thank you for joining me. I'm Simarala, and I'm signing out. Bye, guys.